<sighs> hey there, everyone. This is Rao Kao, and I forgot to put my volume again. Because it's Friday morning, and Fridays I always record at stupid hours. It's kind of unfortunate because we're doing Cuba Castle, and it's gonna take more than one video, so we're not going to be completing it today. I, I hope you all can survive that affront to nature. Now, the thing with the path this time, the gimmick, is that they kind of split. So we're going to have to work out a system with progressive save states in order to be able to do all the roars. But whatever, it's super excitomatic, doromatic, floridomatic, platformomatic action with some coins, and it's just music again, I can VIP 3. It's nice to see traditions are being traditional. Oh my god, spikes that do not fall. Wow, that was kind of scary notion. Hey, miss, just spike ball in there, there's a thwomp, he's so friendly. Look how cuddly he looks like, and for some reason I couldn't spit job on that guy. Whoa! This is action ahoy omatic. Wow, that was a lot of good playing, also. I need some help getting up. Oh my god, it's a rope bridge. Getting excited about rope bridges. Oh man, they changed the spikes, now it's kinda. You can't tell in advance who is going to fall. That is a dirty trick. I'm not singing. Jesus hell, this is kind of scary actually. No! Wow, how the hell did I... Why did I die that way of all things? <laughs> wow. Now that's just jugular vein-ish. Oh, freaking lord. <coughs> oh, there's no VIP co well, there's no VIP coins, but um, every room is going to uh, say stay here, save some time in the future. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it's kind of generic. Uh, well, it's not like having particular power is going to be very useful. It's not like they will ever give me the ability to fry an enemy considering the nature of my enemies and stuff. There we go, thank you very much. There's a road bridge and it's kind of there. Shiny and slimy and bimey and brimey. And you know, all the other dwarves that we don't know about. Because they keep cheating on their taxes and are currently detained for our safety. Whoa, comic son is what you should be abusing and using every day. So here's a door, we're gonna go in the door. The door is the door, we're gonna enter the door. We are in red land, it's filled with math and red. Hey there candlestick, how do you do? Oh my god, it's a golden bonnet. Oh my god, it's balloon guy, and I just kinda fall off. Yeah, the balloons, they don't, they don't work very well, is the best way to, to explain it. Uh, well, it's like the balloons in Hong Kong Country 2, probably made by Crow, considering it's crazy custom block action and inspired by Donkey Kong Country 2. Let's see, the, I do I absolutely must go in details here? I think not. Whoa, they're cool, but assault every day. Wow, that was, that was awesome there, Hakao. Oh my god, Bonsai Bill going on a, a sailing trip. <coughs> So yeah, if you haven't played Donkey Kong Country 2, the gimmick here is that you need to go up the updraft so your balloon can prosper and, you know, win uh, his lady's hand in marriage. It's always so romantic. I am completely asundered. What the hell am I supposed to do here? Okay. <laughs> that was kind of blind navigation there. Uh, well, Jesus, hell, wow, I don't know how I managed that one. Oi. Well, these aren't so much updrafts as friendly little carrots, so uh, I guess that's nice. I mean, uh, typography symbols are always nice to follow. Whoa, typography symbols are forever our... F what the hell was that? What the hell was that? He's half your subconscious to do. Yeah, that place is so unfair though, it's completely blind. Oh well. Blind Cooper topping, by far the greatest thing known to man. Of 
course. Is there like a cave there? Because that'd be useful, like heck. No, there's not. Part, I don't like this part. This part is tricky and dangerous. Alright, so, so far so good. Uh-uh. Uh, hop another one. And then you dodge a bullet, and then you're stuck in a ducking position for a while. Maybe it's because I think my digital pad sometimes gets stuck. And that is an awesome thing, of course. And then we are going over there and hoping I don't get shot. Which I didn't, but well, I got hit, but I mean, it's not too matterful, I suppose. Then we go over there and hop on a couple of balloons. Whoa, 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 whoa. How the hell are you supposed to dodge that? Oh, come on! What? Ah! Stuff. Wanted to have a beak. I am the sad guy. Oh, wow! Ah! Oh my god, my controller's... Ah, uh, freaking lord. Jeez. Okay. And now it's this. Fire it forward a little bit. Where's the other Koopa? Can't see. Oh. Hasn't turned around, so I couldn't see its feathers. Okay, fair enough. I know it's there at least. Go. I need to figure out a way of not getting hit there, but it's crazy. Whoa, okay, so I managed to find a way to not get hit there. Uh, proper timing in a Mario game, who would have guessed? Now it's this crazy place. I don't want to get killed, okay, so stationary. So I suppose that's how you're meant to do it, because it's the only way I can figure it out, but let's get down there this is nuts go up 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 now oh my god these are in the way are they not yes they are attacked by vicious blocks this will make the newspapers they will be all sensationalist about it and no one will be able to trust his brothers oh my god um having fun there mr hammer brother floating around in infamy. I still need that particular balloon. And there are two doors. I'm going to put a safe state here just in case, but I think that was a mis- Okay, so I can get all the way there. Yo, balloon hopper! Oh my god, and there's the power of a pervescent disco surrounding us. We cannot escape the eldritch power of the 70s. Forever tormenting us forever in everness and more words uh, that indicate that it never stops. Just because you know, why not? Wah! Wow, you're allowed to jump. That's that's great. So uh oh my god, now there's a balloon here. Okay, well I'm gonna put a safe state here and uh that's what we're going to be doing actually, no, that's what we're going to be doing next time. Going to be doing like those two doors, and they're going to lead to, each will lead to two other doors. And essentially we're we going to be shenanigan shaped in that way. Let's hope we can figure out a system. Regardless, this is Raokao playing the first part of Koopa's Castle. This is all I have time to play for tonight, uh, today, this morning. Join me tomorrow when, uh... We go further in the castle of Koopa. See you guys.